this is Mary Lou FDG Filipino Dessert Gardener. Today I'm just gonna make a video of the updates on my sproutings. Um, say eight days ago I started uh, sprouting some broccolis and alfalfas and mung beans or mungos in Visayan. So this is what you would need if you would start a sprout uh if you start sprouting in your house so you just need a mason jar with a big mouth and uh, this is just a cheesecloth you just cut up a big a good size to cover the top because you will have to drain the water a couple times a day and you just you put the seeds Here's my broccoli seeds. You put a tablespoon into this jar. You soak it for um, overnight or eight hours and then you drain. And then going forward, you have to change the water or rinse it every, every few hours, maybe every three hours. And then you drain it and then you just leave it like that for a few days. Um, for this is this jar is for you know broccolis or alfalfa and this one I have uh, clover I have some clover red clover um, so that's the one I'm doing it in the mason jar here for the mongo beans so here's the cloth you could buy this cloth and then you just cut a piece to put it in your mason jar but for the um, for the mongo beans or mongos I just use one cup of that one cup of mongo beans and you will need a net you could use like this is from onions like a bag of onions or oranges that comes to the net um, you just cut it off cut down the top one cut down here and then you wash it real good and you would need paper towel because what you would do in this one you put the net first on the bottom of the pot and then you put the paper towel and then you put the spongo beans inside Oh, but at first you have to soak this overnight as well so all the seeds need to be soaked eight hours or overnight and then let me show you what it looks like now so I just put this right on my counter side so it's easy for me to rinse all right so let's see what we have here Da, da, da. This one I just started yesterday. I soak this two overnight and then you rinse it and then you turn it upside down so the water can drain out. So this two is the new one I started yesterday. And this one, I like this one. This is my favorite, my broccoli. So very easy to sp sprout and they're healthy, no dirt involved. So what you do is just rinse it a couple times a day and turn it down and cover it with dark cloth. And here's my alfalfa. It looks like there's a lot of uh, ungerminated seeds in this one but it's okay you still got like a handful of it it's all right so but today we will gonna make sandwich with this broccoli sprouts all right so let's go on to that's seven uh eight days I started it on Jan uh, December 27. Let's do it that way. 
Okay. Like that. And then for my mango beans, for the mung beans, and this is only one cup. And this is how much that much is. So for the mongo beans, you have we are gonna need it flipped upside down so that the water and you just keep doing that. Okay, you pour it like that. And then, so when it's um, taller like that already, you have to put uh, moist paper towel so the top doesn't get dry out and then I've got this one like that until you are ready to rinse them off but I'll show you how to rinse to grab that later all right so Thank you. 